All right, thanks a lot, Joe. Well, as House leadership in Washington recovers from a critical blow after pulling the GOP health care bill from a floor vote, some lawmakers are looking at where to go from here. WENY Washington correspondent Kelly Meyer spoke with Congressman Tom Reed, who says the fight to repeal Obamacare is far from over. There's a lot of raw emotion. New York Congressman Tom Reed is reflecting on a challenging week for Republican lawmakers on Capitol Hill. Is postponed. This after a crucial blow to House leadership after failing to get enough votes to pass the GOP health care bill. House Speaker Paul Ryan pulled the bill from a floor vote late Friday. We came really close today. But Reed says the battle to replace the Affordable Care Act is far from finished. Now we're kind of taking that debrief uh, moment and let uh, emotions die down and then get back to work. So it's not over. No, health care is not over. Here in the Senate, it's a different story as New York senior Senator Chuck Schumer leads the opposition to repeal and replace and is gaining the attention of an unlikely ally, President Trump. We have suggestions we want to make to make the system better. They'll have suggestions we should get in a room and try to make the system better. We're happy to do that. President Trump tweeting on Thursday his frustration with the House Freedom Caucus for them costing the GOP party votes on the health care bill. Trump saying he's willing to work with Democrats down the road. If they got together with us and got a real health care bill, I'd be totally open to it, and I think that's going to happen. Speaker Ryan saying Thursday he's worried members of his party are pushing Trump into working with the Democrats. What I am encouraging our members to do is keep talking with each other until we can get the consensus to pass this bill. But it's very understandable that the president is frustrated. As the bipartisanship battle boils, the future of health care in America remains caught in the middle. Reporting in Washington, I'm Kelly Meyer, WENY News. And Congressman Tom Reed says he agrees they need to do this in a bipartisan way, but says the repeal needs to happen first, then he'll work across the aisle.